this is gonna be my last time trying to do my childhood, okay? Because there's so much I did as a child that was good, okay? That was good. And talking about being born in it, I was born right here in the United States of America. That stands for the Native Americans, the Native people, not the white people, not the Mexicans or you fucking Africans, Native American, Blackfoot and Cherokee. Yes, I'm Creole. Okay, so my heritage is Blackfoot, American, bitch. I am a real fucking American woman, a unique individual. You have a problem with discriminating that's not your type of adult. I'm not your type at all. That's all you have to fucking say and get the fuck on. So, my mom had me in Bellevue, Washington. She had me in Bellevue, Washington. And when she had me in Bellevue, Washington, she didn't know who my dad was. I had a DNA test in middle school. But I'm talking about my childhood, me being a kid. I was molested as a child. I'm being emerged to fuck up the interview again. I can't do an interview without these motherfucking emerging people interrupting it. Really. I was in ABC modeling as a child. They got over on me. They fucked me over as a modeling agency coming up. They did me wrong. And I've been trying to figure out how to sue them people. Yeah, I said it. I've been trying to figure out how to sue ABC Modeling and the city of Seattle. The officer's talking about this is where Al comes in at for prostitution, rape culture, white slavery, pandering, gang stalking, conspiracy. That's where he comes in at. So, I don't want to talk about California, but I was about to start talking about California. They emerge. They Emerging people who, and the person, emerging people that come to America are terrorist people towards free spiritual individuals. People like me who don't know what emerging is to begin with, okay, they lose their pride as an American individual that's free spiritual because they feel contained by the emerging people. The people that control the spiritual world. They're controlling the spirit. They control me to be on skid row because I don't know my way around around California. And they're emerging neighborhoods saying that I'm a prostitute, I'm a gang member. That's pandering. That's called conspiracy, officer. That's invasion of privacy, police officer. I made my police report back in 2012. Multiple police cards. And you guys just talk about, that's a civil lawsuit. Like, I want to sue some people. I wanted to lock them up and have a restraining order on them. So, 
like I said, I was in ABC modeling as a child. And when I was a child, I was molested by my parent. Unfortunately, I don't know who my dad was. But I was molested. He gave me alcohol, hitting the crack pipe. And I was sucking his dick. But that don't give you a right to follow me around and judge me and define my fucking character. Really. I was two years old. And then I went to Head Start Bellevue Community College and I played basketball. I went to the Boys and Girls Club and I played basketball and I was in gymnastics since I was five years old. And I was given an STD at five years old. Yes, I said the shit. I had a CPS case that was unfounded, okay, based upon an unsafe environment with these crooked police officers that don't let that won't let me have a recovery off of being a rape victim off my parents having boundaries of the relatives in laws the community they won't allow my recovery to happen they contain me in white slavery pandering me and won't stop emerging me. They won't. It's a it's a gain of them. I'm my mom's youngest child. They target and gang up on me, all around me as a baby sister. Like it's funny and it's not. It's not at all. They can tell me to leave, but I can't tell them to leave. It's bullshit. It's bullshit. So, I was a baby in ABC modeling. At two years old, I was second dick, bitch. And I love the set dick. But I love the set dick when I'm in love with the man. I just don't like sucking dick like that, bitch. You get the fuck on with trying to hang out with me and suck every nigga's dick. Because I'm not like that. That's why I want your head chopped off. I don't like you. I don't like you at all. Bellevue bitch using my motherfucking YouTube account Washington State all of them Seattle fucking people and drug laws that emerge back Then I went to Boys and Girls Club, and I did gymnastics, and I did basketball, and I had a nice jump shot. See, I'm a child that's really athletic, okay? I'm having back throws. I'm on point guard. I can dribble the ball. I'm also jumping over the fence, unfortunately. I'm running and jumping the fence to get over to go home or go to the park. I'm jumping the fence. And I'm popping the window to get in the fucking house. I'm sliding through the fucking window to get in the fucking house. Yes, I am. I ain't capable of breaking in to the fucking house and getting in. So, they label me a gang member because of that but I never joined the gang but I do but I know how to do them things since I was a little ass kid they keep in the system so 
being a part of the environment, talking about they got a check in my name, and then they give it to me. So I went to Stevenson Elementary School. Don't like people, they raped me. I told them to get off of me, and they wanted to get off of me. Okay, I got raped in elementary school by some other fucking people in my generation who's super cool. Okay, they're so cool. And I end up transferring from Stevenson Elementary School and end up going to Alma Elementary School because there was no buses and I got into a fight in elementary school. Okay, I'm not a dyke bitch. My babysitter, she was molesting me and I had a, this Power Ranger costume. I used to beat her with a stick. Like, bitch, get the fuck on. When I mean leave, I mean leave. Don't stay around. Like, you're so cool, bitch. Leave. I'm not fucking with you. I told you to fucking leave. Yes, I did that. When I was two years old. Okay? When I was five years old. I told you to get the fuck on. Playing that shit. Get the fuck on, you stupid retarded bitch. I'm retarded for posting this on motherfucking YouTube so the world can know it. No, I'm not retarded. Because my life is in danger and I'm by myself and all of you guys are against me laughing at me. Like you guys are the same motherfucking people. You guys ain't the same your damn self. Everybody's a unique individual and ain't got no business judging me and the sin in the world. And you all some sinful ass creatures, your damn self, with the fucked up attitude that need to mind your business and get your own fucking life and stop being a hater on mine. Stop hating on me. Really? Lingering me. Leave. So then, six years old, I was in jail team, shades of colors. I had the purple and white outfit. I was dancing my ass off like I still do now. So I went from ABC modeling to sucking dick bitch and drinking old English to having walks in the back of my ass and my sister seeing bumps on your butt, jumping the fucking fence, sliding the window open, Okay. Going to Stevenson Elementary School. And then I went to Ardmore Elementary School and I played the violin. I played the violin. The violin was fun to play. And I used to chase the bunnies and these chickens. And I used to go blackberry picking. And I just enjoyed, I enjoyed my childhood. Besides the abuse, you can't say my childhood wasn't normal. And I went swimming. I love to go swimming. I love to go roller skating. I can skate my ass off when my ankle wasn't broken. And... Yeah, there's, there's a lot of things that I'm capable of doing that I've been doing since I was a kid that I still fucking do. And they're trying to take that from me and say that I don't do it. They're trying to say that I don't even dance. That I'm not a real dancer. That's what they're trying to say. They're trying to say I'm the one underground and these hoes are not underground because they fucked a celebrity that was offering me a record deal that I can't get because I'm not cool enough. That's what they're saying. I'm not cool enough. It's not about not being a high school graduate. It's that I'm not a cool person. That's what it's about. 
But like I said, I've been smoking weed and I've been dancing since I was six years old. Okay? And I've been drinking and smoking weed since I was nine. And I'm going to continue to do that shit. Ain't nothing changed about me saying that I changed. I ain't changed. I just... It just been revealed that we ain't the same bitch, you retarded ass hoodlum.